Sweaty feet. That's all it is. It's nothing special. It's extremely sweaty feet. I heard a rumour was to protest against the Vietnam War. Is no, that true? No. no. I've heard lots and lots of daft rumours. I very rarely refuse to acknowledge them or deny them because it keeps other people happy. But no, it's just because I've got sweaty feet. <laughs> How long have you not been wearing shoes for? Uh, Sometime in the mid 60s, um, I took them off. I didn't like wearing shoes when I was a kid, but I stopped full time in the mid 60s when there was quite a few people doing it. Um, because there was quite a few of them doing it. I mean, I'm obviously, even looking at me now, you can tell that in the 60s I was a hippie, still am. It's a way of life as far as I'm concerned. Uh, it, it's comfortable. Very comfortable. And even in sub zero temperatures, I'm comfortable. I've heard, I've heard of saying your feet in the snow. Yeah. Yeah, I think there was one of the funniest ones once. I came out of a pub and it was closing time at night. And it had been snowing and there was a good six, seven inches of snow, but it had been packed down by people walking on it. And as you do when you come out of the pub, you stand and have a chat before you go home. And I went to walk home for, you know, from when everybody decided to go home. And I went to walk home, fell flat on my face because I'd sunk in about two inches. I'd melted my way in about two inches. So when I went to walk, my feet couldn't move. I fell flat on my face. <laughs> How long have you making your lighter cases for? Since I stopped smoking, it's got to be... I don't know how many... How long, I've done 21,500 of them. And I go through, I think it's three boxes. At the moment, it's about three boxes a year. So it's about 3,000 a year at the moment. But when I first started doing it, I was only, I was only giving away five or ten a week. So now I'll give away about 50 a week. So it's been quite a few years, it's going to be about 15 years, I think. <laughs> God, you've got so many colours. And also here there's so many about, yes. with your face on it. Yes. <laughs> Have you got any to show us as well? Yeah. Do you want to see them all? Yeah, yeah, pull them out. Where's the tins from? Five, ten, twenty, fifty. Brilliant. I don't want to cover that too much. Oh, fantastic. Is it, is it true that they've been used in the television series Shameless? I believe so, yes. I've been told that apparently somebody went into a brothel and um, tried to pay using one of the 20s. <laughs> Fantastic. And didn't get away with it. <laughs> and that's how we got on the telly, because mm. if this is fake, yeah. which it obviously is. Yes. Um, why do you have a rubber band around your pint glass? Uh, well, I, I do it because I know it's mine. Yeah. Um, I, won't, I won't pick a glass up unless I can feel the band. Yeah. And also, other people, if by accident they don't pick it up, they feel the band and put it down again. Yeah. So do you have a favourite beer? Yes. Without a doubt. Beers. Of all the pups and all the be of beers I've tried over the past 50 years, Beardums. Excellent. Without doubt. Um, so what has changed over the years in Mosley? Um, besides the fact that a lot more pubs, all the small shops have gone, 
mm. which I didn't like. Mm. Um, money's coming back in. Mm. Students, uh, at one time, this was a very, very big student mm. area, but the, uh, the, the students now are not the same as they were back in the 60s and 70s. Then, then they had grants. Mm. And a lot of them were just going to university to have some time off school. And they used to just use the grants to enjoy themselves. It was a basically it was a three year holiday mm. they used to have uh, before they started work. Mm. Um, now the students, because they have to go into so much debt, yeah. they can't afford to do that. Mm. They can't afford to just party for three years. Yeah. They've got to study and they've mm. got to pass. Yeah. Because they need the money to pay back the money that, that pay off mm. the debts they get into. Yeah. What kind of music do you listen to? I don't listen to music at all. Right. I don't like music. I never. I don't hear it the same as everybody else. Mm. Apparently, uh, one time I used to turn on "I'm Torn Up," mm. and people say it doesn't exist. But it does. Mm. You just don't hear it the same as other people. Mm. Apparently, but and somebody said to me, don't, "Don't you miss it? So how can you miss something you never had?" Mm. I've never had the appreciation of music, so mm. it, to me it's just a noise.